It's Luis Martin, the art engineer, and it's December. It's like December 15th or something. No, it's December, and we have a kit to unbox, the last one of the year. Uh, but before that, behind the camera, we have... Chunky Baker here. Chunky Baker. How's the music? It's become a character in our, in our videos. At any rate, um, I'm really excited, as always, because... Um, this is our end-of-year collage kit, so we wanted to make it really special. I put my favorite, absolute favorite collage that I did this year because it's all about power, that power that we have inside. So take a look at it. It's called Systems of Power. So the prompt this month is all about what is your 2022 going to look like? Uh, now is the perfect time to think about what the heck you want 22 to be all about. You have all the power, you have all of the materials, you have all the goods. So I've set the space, I've set the stage. Elvis wants to say something, what? Oh. Don't keep it in, say it, say it, 2022, new year, let it out. Um, I've set the stage, I have my crystals, I have my incense, I have my drink. So be sure you set up your safe space and create a nice place where you can explore and play. Um, People always ask me, how do you stay so inspired? How do you keep doing things? And I'm like, well, it's about numbers, right? Like, it's all random and two and three and two and four and two and seven, two and a gazillion. So don't worry about losing inspiration. Don't worry about losing ideas, uh, endless ideas. Uh, so come on over and I will show you what we have. So I think we're good with the music, it's not too loud. So this is the collage kit. I'm gonna try to use just the material in the collage kit. Now, be sure that you unpack it and see what moves you, make a little pile, right? Our little prompt is here. And this one's special because this one has Elvis' name. We're wishing you love, abundance, and health, you guys. Um, oof, right, look at this, look at that. Look at that. So uh, we got some play money because we couldn't send you $100, uh, but uh, you got it anyway. So of course, when I can get my hands on the Wizard of Oz, I will shred it to pieces and send it your way. So definitely the Wizard of Oz. I have some cats here. Oh. I'm definitely allergic to cats, but I love cats. So let's play with the cat. We have some Beautiful script. Oh, look at this. This is rich. Oh, thank you. Okay, listen, I'm a very serious person, but this, my friends, everyone's getting a page from the far side. I can spend hours by myself laughing, reading these amazing little comics. I won't read any of them. <laughs> okay, I won't read any of them. I want you to check it out. Um, if you don't get the kids, just look at the far side. Amazing. Check this out. This is the Pia... I can't speak French today. The Pièce de Résistance. Look at this. Do you see Elvis? Do you see me? I mean, this is gorgeous. So this is going to be our centerpiece, right? We're going we're gonna to see what we do with this. Um, more beautiful stuff. I have a lovely F. I have a lovely friend here. I have flowers. So you notice I'm putting my pile here that I want to use immediately, and here's a later pile. I have some beautiful baskets. I have Dante. My brother is a uh, Italianist. He studies Italian language and Latin and all these romance languages. He's getting his PhD, so I thought I'd throw that in honor of him. <gasps> More money. Ooh, look at that. Uh, scrumptious stickers. The woods. Ooh, more script. You guys, this is a really fun pack. Look at this. Look at that treatment. Uh, more Wizard of Oz. And stickers. I love stickers. Not necessarily for collaging, but just for fun. And here's my substrate, right? So this is going to be what I'm going to use. And of course, everyone gets a sticker. This is a sticker that I made. Um, about my sister actually. So it's kind of honoring uh, that feminine sisterly energy. So I hope you enjoy it. So let's start with the cat. Elvis, what do you want your 2022 to look like? Health, abundance, me baking more. There you go. I wonder if they can go hand in hand. Do you want to get a cat? No. <laughs> We're allergic, so we can't. Definitely allergic. But um, look how fun they are and mischievous. So I'm gonna have my cat 
I think for now. Early days. I'm gonna have my cat be my centerpiece for this collage. So, actually, huge news for our next uh, collage kit. We have an open call to all of our members. If you're a digital member or if you are a uh, collage kit subscriber, you can enter the open call and you might win, can win, if you submit your work to be the cover of the January 2022 collage kit masterpiece cover. So if you want to be in the cover, now is a good time to join as a member or submit. Submit, submit, submit. All right, so my cat's going to be my... Is there a deadline for that? Yes, good question, the 15th. I knew the 15th meant something. All right, so this is what I want to do. So this is going to be my substrate, guys, right? So you get this piece of cardboard that you can use and you get uh, stickers. So what I thought I would do is I'm going to create a beautiful border for my cat, like a frame. So I'm not going to use this. You can actually use a pen without opening the, the without the ink part I'm thinking or you can use this as a blunt but soft object um, yeah let's play with this so what I'm gonna do is how do I okay I have to think I know exactly what I'm gonna do okay look look at this I'm cutting his little head His little arms. And now, all right, this turned into something completely different than I had thought. I thought, oh, I'm gonna do a little border, but nope. My little cat is about to turn into something very special. So look at that. I mean, even that's kind of interesting, right? You can stop there if you want, but of course do not. Like that. You're not gonna include his tail. Oh, there's a tail, right? Oh, good, good, good eye. His little tail. It's a cat without a tail. A rat. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I know there's tons of cat lovers out there. Actually, my mother just sent me a picture. She says like, she has like six cats all of a sudden. I'm like, what? Oh, it runs in the family, my friends. Okay, so. Now, we'll save the, the tail for a minute, and now I'm gonna turn her into nobility. I'm gonna draw and see what comes of it. Look at that, I'm gonna give her poofy arms. Isn't that funny? Oh my goodness, this is hilarious, you guys. And then I'm gonna give her a big skirt Tell me this isn't the funniest thing you've ever seen. Oh, this is so silly. Okay, so we'll give her more. And how about a little crown? Okay, so this, <laughs> this is stupid, I love it. Okay, so I'm gonna cut her out with her new dress and see what happens. So I want my 2022 to be also full of abundance and health and happiness, but I want humor. I want to laugh this year. I want to laugh. So this little kitty cat is helping me do that. Okay, this is so silly. It's good to be silly, you know? And it's a little bit difficult to cut because it's a thick cardboard, so be very careful because your blade can easily slip and there's the end of your thumb. Check that out. How fun is this? All right. Print, cut, whatever. We're done. You'll see your reflection the entire time there. Yeah. Check that out. Okay, so this, this, I mean, where do you go from here? Okay, so I am going to play with my CD. Always have a CD. Look, it's reflective too. I think that's a running theme with me. So I love this because it's a flower. What's not to love? But 
of course, since our rule, our rule is that um, contrasting, right? Blue and red are contrasting colors, so it'll always complement each other really well. So let's see what I can do with this. That's my pen, not my blade. Wow, I can't, I did that horribly. <laughs> see what I mean? Be very careful. It's slippery today. So like I said, I do prepare for my videos by creating an ambiance. And maybe I put too much cologne that I got it on everything. Everything's slippery. <laughs> okay. So this is something. So see how that contrast just does something? But what I'm not liking is that I did a horrible job. So whenever you do a horrible job, uh, don't try to hide it. Just accentuate it. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna create some rays here. Actually, what if I just do the blue part as like that? That'd be interesting. So if you are giving away gifts this year and are in a tight budget, remember art makes great gifts, but more than anything, art makes a great business. So don't just give your art away and be sure you remind people that they can buy your work, right? Okay, this is kind of fun. So I'm gonna, I'm doing this, you guys. And I'm gonna put these stickers. Okay, I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm too excited here. So I'm going to, I don't know if, her, if the, I'm gonna have to make a tail, I think, because her tail is so boring, right? Did anybody see where the tail went? See, it was so boring, it got lost. All right, whatever, but look, I have the other part of her fur, so I'm just gonna go ahead and create a tail. Remember, use your collaging as drawing material too. Like, look, I'm just kind of drawing a tail here, kind of just going at it as I go along, right? That kind of looks like a tail, right? No? No one's on the wiser. Oh, tail go. Oh, maybe there. Okay, early days, whatever. She's happy without a tail, what can I say? That's nice. I also had what? The Wizard of Oz. And look at this. This is actually really beautiful. Let's play with this. I'm just gonna use my These little crows. So books are always really great resources for collages, obviously, but even children's books are amazing um, because there's just so much to choose from already, right? Kind of like this. So these are the original illustrations of the Wizard of Oz from the original book. So that's kind of um, amazing, right? They're still, they still look so uh, relevant and impactful. I have to say it, there's nothing like jazz, you guys. <laughs> I know I'm old, but I'm not, I'm an old soul, what can I say? This jazz is fantastic. Okay, and I'm gonna play with this F because why the F not? <laughs> Oh, okay. So I'm gonna talk about it, but I don't know the name. There is a very depressing, but very good movie about this man who created these um, paintings of cats. You know who I'm talking about. I can't remember, but uh, if you have a chance, check it out. I'll put it in the description. And I say it's depressing because it's really depressing, kind of loses his mind, but it might be something you wanna watch, especially if you like cats. I just want to add a little bit. That looks really scary, so I'm not going to do that. But the idea was there. Okay, so I have this, I have this. What else can I add, you guys? This is cool. I really do love this Wizard of Oz stuff. But I also don't like to be too, like, obvious about my re my where I get my resources. Um, like, this would be a beautiful tattoo, wouldn't it? And she's having her glasses put on. 
So this is good for a tattoo, but not necessarily for collaging. So listen, these collage kits are multi-use. So be very uh, wary of what you do with them. <laughs> so also let me know in the comments, what else would you like to see in these collage kits? Uh, because I know what I want to see and I will continue to put them in there. But sometimes, um, you know, we get some really good ideas from some of our members. So let me know what you like. Uh, one of my favorite, looking back, one of my favorite um, collage kits was one where everything was black and white. And that was from talking to one of our members, Christine, who's an amazing artist, you guys. So check her out. Check that out. I like that. I mean, oh, okay. You know I'm a sucker for print, for handwriting. Okay, so I'm gonna, what, what do you think looks better? Let's see. This guy, or this guy. Normally I would say this guy just because it's not too busy, but I really do like his face. Even though I don't know who it is and I don't wanna be too, um, take too much liberty with this, but okay, we'll use it anyway. It's the intention, it's the intention. So let me know, let me know what you wanna see in the, in the kits. Even if you're not a member, I'd be really curious to hear uh, what are some of the things that you found perhaps in uh, thrift shops or art supply stores. Well, you know what? I don't go to art supply stores anymore. I find them very boring and I don't know. I mean, they're exciting, but at the same time, it's very like prescribed, right? Like, oh, use the watercolors for this, use this for that. It's like, don't tell me how to use it. It's what I love about collage. You choose how to use what, right? All right, so I love this, and it's a perfect color for our little cat. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Let me create a frame from this really quick, and then we might have our last collage of the year for um for the kit anyway we still have tons of time to create more collages and listen to jazz and you can always go to collagedream.com and um get a prompt we're almost done with our prompt we have five more as of now and we have been doing some amazing work. Listen, it's not about making a pretty picture, it's soul work. Um, this week's prompt, number 20, is inner child, you guys, and that's heavy. So if you wanna be challenged, if you wanna make more than a pretty picture, go check out the prompts and take a class and let me know how it goes. All right, we're almost there. This is beautiful. So this is from a book on, on notes, I think I found somewhere. And um, I think I like the blue better. So see how it kind of fits perfectly? Uh, I purred like a cat. I didn't even try to do that on purpose. See how it fits perfectly on the substrate? Um, so this is all you need. This is all from the kit other than the razor. So really, treat yourself to one of these kits or give them away. It doesn't have to be Christmas or Hanukkah or Kwanzaa. Just give them away and um, look how fun. I'm really enamored with this cat over here. I will say, I think her dress is a little boring. So let me just create a little more drama. Right, and you can create texture by just going, uh, doing simple line work, cross hatching. I'm gonna get angry emails from my members because they've already had their kids for a few days. So they might've already done stuff and didn't uh, draw on this because this is a really fun thing to draw on. See how every little mark accounts it just creates so much more um intrigue right okay love it 
Perhaps I just want to border this here. This might be one of the funnest collages I've made, actually. Listen, you have to find ways to entertain yourself. And uh, cutting paper and making funny things is a perfect way to do that. Oh my gosh. Okay, I think I'm done. But you know what? I'm just going to give my pile one more look. Because why not? This would be kind of funny too, but too dramatic, I think. She's fabulous, but no. Oh, look at this. I just love the far side. And I, I think I need to include it. But then I found this really quick. And look at this. A monkey. You know how I feel about monkeys. So that monkey has to go there. If you don't know how I feel about monkeys, I love monkeys. It's actually my um, Chinese zodiac. Yes, I'm 300 years old. Okay. And maybe, 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 maybe I can just squeeze this in real quick. You can take your time, but I just want to create something kind of fun and dynamic. I'm not going to try to get that world in. And if you're wondering, it says in God's den. <laughs> so existential. Maybe this won't work, but I just think it might be a nice inclusion. Yes, I think, I think, I think we have something. How silly is that? Let's, let's commit. So, let me maybe peek it a little bit more so so there's like a uh, more dimension. So this is my collage. Why does it work? Goodness, because as a matter of fact, my intention was humor, right? 2022, I wanted to be happy and laugh a lot. And wh how? what else is going to make you laugh than a cat with a crown and a dress with no tail? And uh, look, it's a matter of, of perspective. Put on your little emerald goggles and scare the monkeys and uh, forget about time and make lots of money. So don't give away your art, sell it. Uh, if you don't know how to do that, contact me. So this is Luis Martin, the art engineer, and I am wishing you so much joy, uh, curiosity, happiness, but above all, above all, I hope you find purpose and joy in what you do because what you do is super important and it matters. So behind the camera is Chucky Baker here saying happy holidays. Exactly. Uh, mwah, big hugs to everyone and we will see you soon.